Welcome, Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, this is the week of the 13th until the 19th, Aries. You are dealing with the Queen of Swords. Whoever this Queen of Swords is, I see that this person and their partner could have pulled a fast one and they got caught. Now, this person can be an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. Whoever this person is and whatever that was going on, there is no success for this person. The Three of Wands. The energy of the Three of Wands, I see no success for an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person. Um, they are now recognizing 6017 that a project is not for this person. Whoever this person is and whatever was going on is as if an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person said some sort of a project or business was theirs and they recognize it is not true. So whatever is going on, I see um, a lot of you are going to be having a male enemy. Um, whoever this male enemy is, um, it's coming up as an Aries person, whether this Aries person is. Is as if no success for this Aries person. That Aries person could be fired. Um, so you Aries be aware of what is going on. Um, we can't see who is this man, but this man is going to become some of you Aries greatest enemy because they, they are going to be catching this man. Now the cliver of wands. So some sort of a news is coming up and if you are a man that is married or having some sort of a legal issue, no success. Um, if your wife is having some sort of a legal issue, no success. Okay. There is twice the energy of the three of ones. So, um, a lot of you are working with duality. Um, a whole lot of duality that a lot of you are working with. The three of ones is normally the sign of success. Um, but whatever is happening and transpiring, there is a, no success. The three of ones, yes, is the sun in Aries. Um, they are now recognizing something about you, Aries, that is not above water. Um, this energy is that uh, there is some sort of a false height um, that was going on, some sort of a false situation um, that was in play, and they're now going to be recognizing it and shut it down. So Aries, be aware because whoever this Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person is, it come, um, they recognize that this person is a fraud, and they now recognize that this person could have created some sort of an illusion to say that the business was theirs, and they're now recognizing it's not true. At, um, a Virgo person is a very, very upset. A, a Virgo and a Taurus person is very upset. Um, the energy of the Seven of Pentacles is showing up. Changes for a Taurus. Um, whatever is going on, a Taurus is going to find themselves in some sort of a serious situation. Um, if a Taurus was, um, um, was in jail or was contained, um, this Taurus is going to be um, released. The Taurus is not worried because they recognize um, that an Aries and a Taurus, um, you Aries and a Taurus could have done something that was not above water. And they have now caught the Taurus because the Taurus, the Nine of Swords is about a whole lot of worries, a whole lot of worries about a project, a business, a whole lot of worries is coming up if you're dealing with a Taurus. Some of you are a, uh, worried about work um, that is coming up and a Gemini is going to be fired. A Gemini woman or a Gemini man is going to be fired. It's coming up as a Gemini woman. They're now recognizing who is this Gemini woman um, and they're recognizing um, that this Gemini woman could have created some sort of an illusion or disillusion and they're recognizing this. Now, the energy of the Seven of Pentacles is about changes at the workplace, changes with your, um, your, um, if you are, if you have a business self-employed, there's going to be some sort of a changes that is coming up. So if you are self-employed, um, expect some sort of a changes is coming up for a lot of you. Whatever is going on, um, this changes that is coming up, 
Um, it can be for your, your own project, but it can also um, be for someone else's project. So be aware of this, okay? There's a lot of worries, a lot of worries because they're now recognizing that a Gemini person, it's not their project. Um, then when we look at the Six of Swords, the secrecy of a whole lot of money, I see sadness. Um, the Six of Swords is showing up a whole lot of secrecy. Um, this is the energy of the Ace of Pentacles. And whatever is going on, a lot of people are going to be gaining a lot of knowledge over this Gemini woman and a lot of money. And I see a whole lot of sadness. So some of you are dealing with a Gemini woman. Um, um, some of you could be dealing with an Aquarian. An Aquarian could be recognizing um, a situation. Um, what we're seeing here is... Uh, um, a lot of you are going to be getting news. If you're divorcing, if you have legal issue, you're going to be getting news. I see they're going to be finding out what a, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person, that they're a fraud. And they were pretending to be as if some sort of a project was theirs. And I see sadness because they recognize that this person wasn't speaking the truth, okay? Um, you Aries men could have some sort of a connection um, with this uh, um, a Gemini person. And I see you Aries men are going to become an enemy to this uh, um, Gemini person because uh, um, you Aries men is now recognizing um, what this um, person have done. Their secrets is now out. And so a lot of you and a lot of you are going to be having a male as your enemy because they found out uh, whoever this may this person is is a fraud and whoever this man is had collaborated with someone um and created some sort of a document or um, um, um created a way that this person could show that it was their business and they're going to be recognizing that a man, whoever this man is, had helped them because it's not showing up who this man is. And I see um, whoever this man is, there is uh, some sort of a legal action that is going to be taken against this man. So this man is going to become some of you greatest enemy, whoever this man is, because news is going to be coming in. So let's say that you had some sort of a um, dispute with someone. Um, news is going to be coming in. Um, because they're going to be finding out that this person, whoever this man is, uh, is not above water. For some of you, it's your enemy and your enemy is going to be caught because they're not going to be recognized who this person is. Okay. A lot of you know success um, is as if uh, some of you Aries uh, um, could have collaborated. Um, a lot of you Aries is going to be getting over a problematic situation that you were dealing with whatever that is going on and is transpiring a lot of you Aries is going to be overcoming this now number 33 um this is a very um a strong number this number 33 is a very strong number whenever number 33 comes up it's as if your angels and guides showed up something that was going on um, that was not based on a um, positive frequency of energy. So you successfully overcome because it's as if an, um, someone wanted to pull a fast one and they have caught this person, okay? Um, whatever th the situation is, so, um, you need to, to let it go, okay? Because they've caught whoever this person is, so. Now, when we look at this project, um, there is going to be changes because that is seven. There's going to be changes coming up surrounding a project or a business. And there is going to be some sort of a sadness. And th this situation is that some of you um, could have been collaborating with a Taurus or a Gemini person. This is this is going to be affecting people who are collaborating, working together with a Taurus or a Gemini person on a project or so. And um, this is going to be um, showed up what was going on. So they are not recognizing um, 
and I see this Gemini person is very worried. This woman is very worried because they're recognizing that this woman and her husband um, could be, could have defraud. I see sadness for this woman, whoever this woman is, because whatever is going on with this lady, they're recognizing that some sort of a project or something that this lady said um, that was theirs is not theirs. And it has to do with a Taurus and a Gemini woman. When we look at the um, situation, the Six of Swords is always the moon in Aquarius. And whatever this moon is in Aquarius, the secret is coming out about a whole lot of money. That is going to be bringing sadness um, to a, um, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person. But it doesn't have to be. It is as if this person showed up or the secrecy that someone was keeping this person as revealed. So when we look, news is going to be coming in that you're going to be successfully overcoming some sort of a, a false thing that was going on because details and information now is shown up and they're now recognizing um, that this person, whoever this person is, um, it can be a mother, daughter, it can be um, sisters and brothers, it can be your, your family members. And this person is now recognizing that they could be doing time in jail for something um, that they have done. Okay, so whoever this lady is, is very much melancholy because and saddened because they pull, they did something. It's as if this uh, lady, whoever this lady is, um, has been, uh, she and her husband or um, she and friends have been mask mining some plan and was doing things that was not above water and here you're recognizing uh, for some of you the 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 husband um of a aquarian gemini or libra could be caught for something and as we look at this i see your enemy is going to be caught because and i see sadness for your enemy so whatever is going on um and a lot of you who are married to Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, um, they're going to be recognizing something about this lady um, and whatever is going on. Because a lot of you are going to be getting news that uh, um, um, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran woman and a man is going to become your greatest enemy. Because you're going to be recognizing that there was some sort of a false plane that was going on. Uh, whoever this man is and whatever was going on, um, there was a lot of false playing. I see melancholy regrets. I see communication had given up um, a lot of stuff. And whatever this communication is, I see this woman is now in a mood of melancholy and a whole lot of sadness is coming up. So Aries, be aware. Be aware of what is happening and transpiring um you got to be very very much aware of your um uh you know around you in this week whatever is transpiring um be very very positive um, um whatever is going on just be very positive um be very understanding and and positive i see they're coming down on um something that was going on that was not above water um, with a project. And I see a whole lot of sadness is coming out. You Aries man is going to become um, an enemy to a Gemini woman because the secrecy of a Gemini and an Aquarian is now out. Namaste.